another minecraft video today we're going to be trying out something different um we're actually going to be playing the new caves and cliffs update i've already started the little thing but you know not much so pretty much starting from the beginning um yeah this isn't really supposed to be a series or anything i might do a few videos on it just a survival world where i test out the new caves and cliffs stuff as you know my as you might know sorry um my Minecraft Hardcore series, um, there was a part where, like, my YouTube channel just wouldn't let me upload certain videos, and episodes 2, 3, and 4 of my Minecraft Hardcore series got cut, so can't do those anymore, really. So, yeah. This is the random world I've loaded up. I've just been getting some small materials, but we gotta go get some wood, so should do that. So, yeah, I just plan to mess around. I want to get some copper today and just try out some stuff with that. Yeah. Sorry for no longer videos. I actually recorded a Brawl Stars video and a Minecraft Servers video and forgot to put my microphone on. So that was great. Um. Yeah. In, those, in the Brawl Stars video, I ended up getting Gale too and my first star power. So, rip. Alright. Cut down a tree. Just the first thing I need to do, like, the cave part isn't even out yet. Like, I just really want, like, the cave up aren't even updated yet, but I need to get copper or amethyst. I'm already getting hungry. Alright. Wait, why'd I plant those saplings? I can take those with me. We're gonna need these. So I want to go live on top of that mountain, mainly because there's usually caves on mountains, I can already see one right there. So that's what we're going to do. Plus, I also need meat, or any other type of food. Any fish? Fish! Pickaxe them to death. They drop bones too, that's just sad. Alright. Just get on top of the mountain, see what we can see. Maybe set up a starter base. Let's just use my wood, I can grow more. Speaking of that, uh, there's a new Minecraft server coming out for Bedrock. It's not gonna be a good one. Pretty much all the games you have to pay to play, except for Spleef, so... Who knows, might do a video on it. Probably not. Alright, we have a nice little area over here. Sugar cane down there. Oh, and the new goats! Hello there, Mr. Goat. I know they ram you if you annoy them, so I'm gonna leave him alone. Alright, let's cook this salmon. And plant these trees. Cave? Nope. I want to find a good cave around here, just so I have somewhere to go mining. Oh yeah, there's the new coal texture. They changed how a bunch of the ores look, which I'm not sure how I feel about. I kind of like the old ones. Eat our fish. Oh, gosh, really? Oh, boy. This is not good. Out of all the mobs that could attack me on my first night, it's a witch. Oh, boy. Oh, that stupid freaking slowness. Uh, we're just gonna have to work around it. I don't have any wood. No, I guess I do. Alright. Let's get some coal. Didn't realize how long witches' potions last for. Just gotta hope the witch despawns eventually. So yeah, this isn't hardcore or anything. I'm just more me messing around with the new update. 
I want to get some of those new drip leaf things. Oh, come on. I was totally out of the range of that. How am I going to fight that thing? I don't even have a sword yet. Okay, we're ditching that base. We gotta go. Hopefully it didn't follow us. This is a bad situation to be in right now. Just make more torches. Alright. Let's explore the cave. And there's nothing here. Wow, great cave. What about up here? Nope. Guess we're going this way. Reaper. Don't want to mess with him. Okay. Not a very good cave. Has the witch left my base alone? Just want my furnace. Grab it and go! Oh, the witch fell into the pond. That's nice. Okay, so we're already not in a great situation. <laughs> just gotta wait till it gets to morning, but I guess we can just explore more of this cave, set up a little base. Maybe we could live in a cave. I mean, the new update, that would make sense. Oh, I thought it was a mob. Alright, let's get ourselves a sword. That'll make things a lot easier. I do have one iron bar that I just found earlier. Okay. Cow, give me the meat. I'm hungry. Alright, put this in. Good. Now we have food. While we wait for that to cook, let's go down here and just mine up some coal. I'll skip ahead to when this is done. Alright guys, finish mining out the coal. Let's go back to our furnace over there, see if the meat's done cooking. It has. There we go. a little peek up to the surface, see if any creatures are still around. It's still dark out, so skeleton over there, I think, anyway. Spider! Okay. We chill? We are not chill. How to slaughter him? I want your string. I need a fishing rod. That would actually help out a lot. Alright, now that I got a sword, let's just go hunt these creatures down. Die. Uh, what hit me? Oh. <laughs> Which one will win? I love it when this happens. I'm putting bets on the guy in the cave. He's hitting more of his shots. Oh. Say that, but he just missed. <laughs> This is hilarious. I gotta make sure nothing's sneaking up on me. I can't tell who's winning. This guy won! And now I gotta kill you too. Sorry. Alright. Back down here. I think we got enough string to make a fishing rod now, so that's good. Let's make one of those. And now we can go fishing for food. But I don't want to just do a regular Minecraft video. Soon, once it gets day out and then we can go explore, I'm going to get myself some wood. Then I'm going to go mining. Because I really want to get some of the new ores and stuff. Do you need an iron pickaxe to mine copper ore? I guess we'll find out. Holy crud, there's everything. I just, I just met the cows. Holy crud. I also want to get a goat to attack me. I don't know why. I just think it'd be funny. Okay, I'm getting bombarded from every side. Time to run. Okay, I'm actually pretty weak. I'm actually pretty weak. Dodge and weave. Dodge and weave. Get into the cave. 
Gotta eat. No, it's following me. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Okay, it's fine. Put the meat. Oh boy. Die, 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 die. Okay. That was close. Uh, I'm gonna start digging a mine shaft here. Something to do. Do I have any wood left for torches? I do. I just want to find some of the new copper stuff. Take these out. Oh, let's get some food. Let's go. And just keep going down. All one pause if we find anything. Alright guys, we found some iron with the new iron texture on. I don't like the new iron texture. Like, some of the new textures look okay, but iron is probably my least favorite one. But, I won't complain. And now, iron actually doesn't drop the ore. If I look into my inventory, I think I got, like, raw iron or something. That's what you smelt now. So, yeah. That's a thing, I guess. Just gonna keep mining. Alright guys, we're making some progress. I gotta... Almost a half a stack of raw iron now, so yeah, I'll keep to updating you on our progress. Guys, guys, this is one of the new glow squid things. I think we busted into a water cave and there's glow squids everywhere. What the heck? Okay, we need to bust open an opening. Okay, we found a cave. And there's glow squid, the unfortunate winner of the mob vote. And copper! Okay, yes, this is a good cave. Uh, Sorry, glow squids, but I gotta kill you for your ink sacks. And what is this stuff? Okay, okay, we have stuff to look at. Oh, is this the glow lichen? Uh, I don't know how to get it. There's lava right here, that makes me nervous. We're gonna block that off. Okay. So let's take the stack of andesite that I got, so that way we can build ourselves a little bit of a platform. And I believe this stuff is- oh, it doesn't drop, does it? Oops. Well, um, that's the glow lichen. And do you need an iron pickaxe to get copper? You do not, okay. Oh, and it drops more for one than one per ore. Alright. Let's get this copper then. This stuff is really cool. So we can start experimenting with it in our first video. Nice. Alright, take all this out. Once again, this is probably not going to be that long of a series. Just a few episodes. Just me experimenting with all the new stuff in survival. Gotta wait for a wandering trader, because that's how you're going to get some of this stuff. Well, with that, I actually think that I've collected enough stuff, so I'm going to head back to the surface, and we'll see what we can do with all this new stuff. Alright guys, we're back on the surface. I'm going to start the copper cooking. I want to see what we get. I mean, obviously we're going to get copper ingots, but I want to see what we can do with that. It's also daytime, so let's go and see if anything's happened. Got our small tree farm over here, and there's more goats. Hello there, Mr. Goats. Oh, there's more goats than one goat. Hello. If I punch you, will you ram me? I want to see him ram me. Attack me. They aren't going to attack me. Okay, a cow. You shall be sacrificed for food. Do the goats give any meat? It's a test we'll have to do later. Just go get some more meat from these cows, and we'll go back, and then we'll see about our new copper. I know, like, you can make copper blocks that slowly, like, oxidize or whatever, so that'll be cool to try out. Alright, I'll meet you back at the base. Alright, guys, I actually found a, I think, another cave. So we're gonna, we're gonna look in here quick. How do you get into here? Oh, boy. 
That's what I don't want to see. Why am I not? Why am I crouching? Okay, okay. You're bad, skeleton. Die. Alright, let's search this place. Okay, nothing here. I'll come back and get this coal later. She ran out of torches, so uh, let's go back to the base. Alright guys, we're back to the base. So, nice 17 copper ingots. So what can we do with these? Copper blocks. Lightning rods. Oh, there is stuff we need to try. Let's craft a lightning rod and a copper block. So, this is the copper block, I guess. And we can pick it back up. And the lightning rod, I know this will actually attract lightning. I want to see if we can get this thing, like, hooked up so it'll work. We should also probably craft a chest. I'm going to go get some wood quick. Let the rest of that cook. So, yeah. Alright. Cut down this tree quick. Then we also got the the glow dye stuff, the glow ink sacks that I want to try and use later on. I know you can make like glow item frames and neon colorings with them, so yeah. Let's go over here. Craft up a double chest. Oh, we can also craft these raw iron blocks. Eh, I won't do that now. Alright, let's get the chest. Put this over here. Can go in there. Alright, the rest of the coffer we're also gonna store in there. Use it later, and then we'll work with this stuff. I'm actually gonna put this lightning rod outside. See if, who knows, maybe we can catch some lightning with it. Up. It's getting darker again, so let's retreat back in our cave. Alright, let's get this, put the raw iron in. Put this stuff away, and then we'll also put our glowing sacks in there for now. Let's light up some more around our base while we... Still have time left in the episode. Alright, get some sticks. Take a little fuel. Let's go light up stuff. And we'll keep the rest for our next caving adventure. I just had a skeleton come over from here earlier and almost kill me, so I'm gonna light it up. And then out here... Before the entire mob horde is spawned, I want to light up as much as I can. Oh, that zombie. It has stuff. Did it get a wandering trader or something? It has a lead. Did it drop its helmet? It did not. Alright. Just want to light up before the apocalypse happens. Alright. Back in our cave. Let's craft up some iron stuff, and then we can pretty much end the episode. We've done a lot of progress today, so... Yeah. That's good. On um, second thought, I'll craft the iron stuff later. Oh, wait, a wandering trader. Oh, that's where he must have got the leads. Oh, no, the trader's still here. Let's see what he has. If there's not death close by. Sorry, didn't want to punch you. Don't don't spit on me, please. No, no. Stupid zombie. There's two of them. No, there's a skeleton. Okay, okay. I will clear this out quick. Alright guys, let's get back over to this traitor. Still a stupid spider. No, no, what else is there now? Why? No. Oh my god. This is my third time running back to the base. I don't have any food. 
Just leave me alone. Please. Okay. Let's just get in the cave. We'll talk to the trader later. Get get, get this get this out. Cook food. All right, let's put our iron away. Okay, it's good. All right, let's heal up. And let's run back out. Goats, please don't choose this time to attack me. Because after I respawned, I would kill the goats. All right. Where'd, where'd the trader go? Please don't tell me he despawned. Whoa, okay. There's zombies everywhere. Let's just... I think we lost the trader. Let's wait till morning, and then we'll see. Alright guys, we found the trader. And I don't think there's anything near him, so let's just have a quick look. No, where's your where's your owner? Where's your owner? Need to talk to him. Alright, anything new? You're supposed to have new stuff. Come on. All of that for nothing. Bye bye llamas. I need your leads. Where's the trader himself? Give me the leads. Can't hit him. Where'd he go? He died. Nice. Now we have two leads. Let's get out of here. You might think it's cruel to kill the trader, but it actually increases the spawn on all their own, so... It's not too bad of a thing. Go back down here. Alright, everything's done cooking. And I think that'll be the end of this video, guys. We figured out about copper. We got some glowing sacks. We're figuring more about out about this update. So yeah, I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Bye! <laughs>